taking some pictures? Yeah, of birds. There's some owls that hang around in this parking lot. Oh, really? Yeah. i never seen them. But I see sometimes too, I see bats. Bats, really? Oh, yeah. that's crazy. At yeah, this they, time? They, they, they like sometimes they like fly from from my palm tree to another palm tree. Thanks for the heads up on the bats. Oh, you're welcome. Anyways, Michael Reeves has really dense bones and he slams around on the second story of our house at night and it keeps me up. So I'm going to build something. Okay, I'm gonna t I'm gonna electrify the carpet. Also recently I've been checking to see if uh, how often the ice cream machines at different McDonald's are broken. It's kind of an excuse just to eat more ice cream, but. Is Michael Reeves a good roommate? Yeah, he's not bad. He pays his rent on time. Here's the problem. I need sleep and I'm not getting it. This is my room. This is the living room. My room, living room, my room, living room, living room. My room, and this is the ceiling between us. That looks really bad. I'm not really sure how I thought I was gonna show a ceiling. A ceiling fan. You can't really tell there's a problem, but it's more of a sound thing. And when Michael is bounding across the room like a troglodyte, the ceiling makes this terrible creaking noise. It's much louder on the bottom floor than it is up top. I, I, I don't know how it's so loud. It's really loud. Caretaker, what are you doing? Stomping like you're talking. <laughs> you think being a responsible adult, I would have talked to Michael and used my words to express my frustration. I tried that. That's the first thing I tried. Hey Michael, I was wondering if you could kind of late at night not walk around. So, hey Michael. My, hey Michael. Contact microphone! Oh. Mr. Bones, could you do me a solid and help put this contact microphone on the ceiling? Where did I put my camera? Oh, you should you shouldn't be down here. Alright, come on up. Let me show you. Ready for some for some nerd stuff. I've been working hard for a couple hours. You've got an Arduino, another Arduino, two relay boards, an op amp, a Furby that I'm gonna drop kick across the room, an expensive oscilloscope. Oh my god, this camera won't focus. Wireless transmitter. A wireless receiver. They're two feet apart. One foot apart? I don't know. I, I, uh, I had some problems. Why? Oh god, why won't this camera focus? Let me try to explain this to you in less than 10 seconds. There's a contact microphone which sends the signal of the sounds from the floor to an operational amplifier which sends that wirelessly two feet to another Arduino which counts the number of times the floor was smacked and if it's over a certain number of times it triggers a relay which lights up an LED strip and then another relay which lights up the floor with a taser which we have not bought yet. Was that 10 seconds? Basically what happens is when you smack the floor, it detects it. All we need is an electric fence. And actually it took me like five different stores to find one. I need an electric fence for a big kind of hairless dog. Electric fence? Yeah, like not the wireless ones, like something that actually is the wire. You guys don't do that? Won't happen. Do you know? In, inhumane for Oh really? Yeah. Hello, I'm looking for a an electric fence for a big kind of hairless dog. For a big dog? Yeah. Like an, like an above ground fence. And when I found one, I bought the biggest one. Do you have any idea how bad this would hurt a human? Hurt a what? A human, like if a human accidentally touched it. They'd be stupid to not pay attention and touch it, but I mean, I don't know if it's gonna, it's just gonna. Okay, it'd just be a little go. painful. Oh, ow. It can tase wolves, it can tase cows, it can tase a horse, it can tase deer. It, oh, oh look at that. Look at that. Big, hairless dogs. All right, I don't really know how to use this thing. Um, 12 volt battery. Oh, we're just gonna hook it up. What's the worst that could happen? Oh, it sends out a pulse. Oh, I really don't wanna touch this. You can hear it popping. 
Oh, should I touch it? I don't want to touch it. I'm going to just put my arm on the, on the red one and not really complete the circuit or anything. Uh, oh, okay. You have to be touching both. Um, I don't know why I'm so scared of this. Oh, I really don't want to do this. Okay, how bad could it be? Why? Why is this so hard? Oh! That was really bad. Holy crap. Hello, I need to return this. Sure. I gotta exchange it for something for a smaller dog. The big one's more powerful than I realized it was. You don't wanna like find your little guy? Yeah, no, he was not happy. Okay, do you wanna go grab it and then Yeah, come okay, back? there we yeah, yeah, no problem. Let's go with that one. Yeah. Is the ice cream machine broken or? Uh, no, overnight didn't clean it, so we have to clean it right now. Okay, you hear that? She said overnight didn't clean it, so they have to clean it right now. I think we're on to something. Is it a conspiracy or is it just lazy employees? I'm not really sure, we'll figure it out one day. I forgot to mention that the contact mic, it's not in the ceiling anymore because I was having trouble with the uh, wireless transmitter and receiver. So I moved everything upstairs, which is totally fine because the vibrations just travel through everything. I present to you Taser Carpet. I, I could not come up with a better name. I use two pieces of wood to strand the electric tape. And if you look closely at this stuff, you can see fine metallic strands in there. So this is conducting electricity. And then every other strand is a positive ground, positive ground, positive ground. So if you step anywhere on this, you will most likely be touching at least one positive and one ground. All right, let's plug it in. I can't build up the courage to walk around. This is really sad. Why, why feet? Why did I pick feet? <laughs> It says it's for rabbits, it should be fine, right? Uh, you're Michael Reeves, you're walking around really late at night, three in the morning, you're just, you're stomping in the living room. Ah! 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 <laughs> I would. <laughs> I don't feel bad for you, you I think, I think I would immediately get off the carpet. It's like a bunch of little needles. Ah! Spam musubis are a Hawaiian delicacy. A spam musubi consists of a slice of the finest canned lunch meat on rice wrapped with seaweed. It is an incredibly popular snack in Hawaii. The dish was created by Barbara Fun uh, Mura, who died in 2016. I'm just reading the Wikipedia article. Michael is from Hawaii, therefore he loves Spam Musa Bees. Go in the living room, there's a couple of Spam Musa Bees. Uh, I left there's them there no for you. No, there's no. It's, there's two Spam Musa I've, Bees. I've left my room today. There's, there's an electric carpet. There are two Spam Musa Bees Mitsubishis hanging I out. I like Spam Musa Bees. Just sort of like fixate on the Spam Musa Bees and don't look too far down. See, they're right, they're right over there by the electronics. You see them? Oh, uh, uh, yeah, okay, you have socks on, good. <laughs> but I'm it's walking right now. What the f is that? It's very sensitive. Me too. You can't, you can't walk in between it. That's cheating. Just run across it. <laughs> Oh, these look a lot shittier up close. <laughs> <laughs> oh, never mind. No, they're, uh, wait, wait, no, they're. Wait, no, they're. What do you mean? Oh, That's just. Them. It's just from the pan. Uh -huh. It's literally going off right now. Just let yeah. it calm down. I'm just jumping into an electric fence at this yeah. point. Do it. <sighs> it just. It's just straight up on. Why are you doing that? Well, yeah, I don't know. <laughs> it doesn't hurt, it's just very startling. You are so sweaty right now. This is pretty pointless. <laughs> I feel like the problem statement was much more grand oh my than the gosh. actual application. Yeah, the application did not look Well, the like whole that. point was supposed to be a surprise, oh and then God, I did a bad are. job surprising you. Ah! <laughs> I guess the carpet didn't do exactly what I intended it on doing to taste someone in the middle of the night. Michael specifically. Oh, and uh, if you want to win the Arduino that I totally fried by powering the five volt rail with 12 volts, leave a comment and I'll send you this. It's, it's literally trash. If you want trash, leave a comment.